Let's show you a wild KTM like you have never seen before. This is an open class bike for hill climbing. Take a look at the motor. What is it? Anybody got any guesses? How about a 1290 beefy beast wrapped into this custom chassis. This motor was never meant for the dirt. This was meant to be out on the highway, but this is what you see in the open category. Rules in the open category, you're allowed nitro methane, nitrous. This one decides to run on gasoline. It's an all motor bike. It all comes down to preference. Take a look at the technology. You'll know the flyby wire system. There's no throttle cable here. Everything is controlled electronically. In terms of tires, they're allowed to run chains if they want. There can be metal. No metal in use right now. It all comes down to tuning and personal preference. The crew chief is with me. Man, what a marvel of engineering. Uh, this thing this thing is wild. How many hours to put this together? Oh, I'm not sure. I actually just funded it. We've got a local builder that did just as you can see a beautiful job by having it balance well, ride well, handle well. The running of it is outstanding. Tell me a little bit more about that motor and, and what it was like putting the 1290 in and the selection to use the 1290. That's a big motor, huh? <laughs> Well, you look at uh, one of those, unfortunately there's so many bikes on the road, and this is one of those that came out of a wrecked bike, so we put it into the frame and ran all the factory components, and the tuning KTM has is far superior to anything else on the road today. So we and what we have is just a fabulous bike. It's an amazing bike, it really is. Now I know in this class, to get up the hill, to get up this massive hill, we see a lot of competitors running nitrous, turbos, nitro, methane, a lot of power adders. You guys are all motor. Why all motor? Um, it's just easy. We only have one fuel we carry us with us, and we are able to uh, have one gas can, and that's what we ran with it, and it's just easier. What's the maintenance like on this bike? Um, we uh, change the oil maybe once a year, uh, clean the air filter, and that's it. That's great, huh? Yeah. I wonder, now, could you guys potentially be trendsetters? Could, would it be possible to even take that bike out on the, tr on the trails or a dirt road and ride it? Or is it just simply for short journeys up the hill? Well, for us, we could do that very easily and have it for a trail riding bike. Except in California, we have to have the sound requirements. And with this, we don't have a radiator. Okay. So we for a very short distance up the hill. It's a beautiful bike. Anything you'd like to add? Oh, I just appreciate the sponsors. And hopefully you guys uh, exposing this to a lot of people. They enjoy watching it. So you, thank you. You got it, man. Thanks a lot for showing us. We told you it was a KTM like you've never seen before. Could you imagine what this thing is like up a hill or in the trails? It is absolutely a beautiful, beautiful piece of engineering. Let's give you a full walk around here. Gorgeous motorcycle. Custom exhaust and the big paddle. Beautiful machine. It's what it takes to get up the hill.